welcome back. Welcome to another day. Welcome to another video. Pretty excited about today's video for several reasons. We're doing a little more cleaning here in the house. There's some things that need to be done. Uh, I, as I was unpacking in the bathroom, I was just throwing things in the bathtub, empty bags and stuff like that. And so I need to get all that cleaned out and clean out the bathtub again. Y'all know my floors have been a mess when they were setting up the house and doing all the things they just walked through with their muddy shoes and didn't think twice about it and the floors were a disaster and i have cleaned them several times i also got me an o cedar spin mop i've wanted one for a while when i used to teach pre pre-k we used an o cedar spin mop and i loved it loved it we used it in our classrooms and i always wanted to get me one and i never did but i finally have and i used it to mop from the den all the way to the kitchen, but I haven't done my bedroom and bathroom yet. And the kids are begging to help with it. That's another thing about those mops. The kids love them. And my boys are begging to help mop my bedroom and bathroom. So we're gonna do that. I also got some things to decorate up on the shelf up above my refrigerator when we unpacked the kitchen. I talked about that a little bit. I got some stuff. We're gonna put it up there, see what we can do with it. And uh, yeah. I think that's gonna be fun. Today's video is also a collab with Courtney from Courtney Danielle. I have followed her for a long time. I feel like we have a lot in common. Uh, she has three boys and her youngest, Miles, is the same age as White. And when I say same age, I mean, I think there's like a day difference in them. They're very, very close in age. And so I love watching how she's handling motherhood and the approach she's taking to having a newborn. And y'all, she's very real, very down to earth. That's how I try to be, too, and I can see that in her, and I think that draws me to her. So, if you enjoy my channel, I'm sure you'll enjoy hers. Go check her out. I'll leave a link down in the description box, and if you're coming over from Courtney's channel, well, hello and welcome. I'm Tiffany, and this is Our Small Town Life. Just a little bit of background on us before we get into today's video. My husband, Justin, and I recently purchased this double-wide mobile home that we're trying real hard <laughs> to get moved into. Uh, I'm thinking that either tomorrow night or the next should be our first night here in this home but we're working on getting moved into this home we put it on a little bit of land that we have big dreams for and turning it into our own one acre homestead trying to live a more self-sustaining self-sufficient lifestyle we're sharing all that here on this channel we have four kids ranging in age from 12 years old all the way down to eight months old and we just share day-to-day -day life, showing you what it looks like to live in a small town in the southern United States. So if any of that sounds interesting to you, well, hit that subscribe button. Join our crew. We sure would love to have you. I've got all kinds of things here on the counter that I brought in. Some of the stuff that I got at Walmart and at Dollar Tree to decorate with. Some cleaning stuff. Just all kinds of stuff sitting on the counter behind me. I need to get that cleaned off. I think what I'll do is get the boys started mopping in my room. We'll see how long it lasts. I'm sure I will end up in there mopping. But I'm going to get them started. And then I think I'll come back in here and do these shelves. And then we'll just keep on cleaning. I do have to get this stuff done pretty quick though. Because here in just a little while we've got to go to fall practice. Just kind of showing you what our afternoon's like today. Here in just a little bit, Huddy's got ball practice, so I need to kind of push through this stuff pretty quick. Show me what it's like to be circling among the clouds Because without you by my side I would be stuck here on the ground You're lighting up the way I can see the road ahead of me I won't be stumbling in the dark Your eyes are shining like the stars I was down Until you saved me Until you set me free My eyes were closed Now I see clear as day And I just wanted to say That you can take me high it Feels like I can fly take me high I can see the sun staring at you when you make that smile I'm moving closer to you now I can't get close enough somehow oh. and I was down 
until you say all right they're in there mopping and i'm going to show you some of the things that we got today from walmart and dollar tree some of them are, are to decorate up here with and some of them aren't but i just thought i'd show it all to you we got a shower curtain with hooks for the kids bathroom we also got a tension rod but we left it over at justin's mom's we forgot to bring it so i'm not gonna be able to put that up today and i really wanted to we got that we got that from Walmart. This came from Dollar Tree. Huddy saw this and he is decorating his new room in dinosaurs. And so he thought this was perfect. So we got that for him. This plate came from Walmart. It's Pioneer Woman. Did you grab it up? You gonna go try it out? Yeah. Okay. This came from Pioneer. This came from Walmart. It's Pioneer Woman. I'll get my words right in just a minute. It's not, it's plastic and it's this perfect teal blue color that I have accents of in my house so I got that these came from Dollar Tree they're in the Easter section but I just I think they're cute I may actually leave them in this carton and prop them up on the shelves I don't know we'll have to see both of these came from Walmart it's a eucalyptus stem and some lamb's ear and this came from Dollar Tree I thought that was very pretty so we'll see if we can use it somewhere i have another sign hey audrey oh here it is let's see i know i saw her with it a while ago i got this from dollar tree i don't know if it's gonna fit up there or not i think it's too tall i may have to put it somewhere else but it was really cute i want to pass it up as a matter of fact, I have a few clips of some different things. I may have shown me getting some of this stuff. I can't remember, but I got a couple of clips in Dollar Tree while I'm getting all of this stuff ready to go up on the shelf and getting my camera set up. I'll insert those clips for you and let you watch that. this plugged in but it doesn't it takes batteries and you can just sit it on your dresser or something and use it so I'll have to get him some batteries for it he was excited to try it out and I thought it plugged in but it doesn't here you go buddy sorry so up here right now I have a cake plate that I thought would fit but it's too tall I may still go ahead and separate it and put it up there somehow I don't know we'll have to see and then that picture right there came from my sweet friend Sammy when we did a box swap. I'm going to use it up there somehow. What does it say? Bless this nest, I think is what it says. So I'm going to hop up here, play around with this stuff, and see what we can make happen. Putty wants to hop up there and help, so we're going to let him do that. Pizza scooper. Yeah, like the thing that it's pizza with. No, I think it's supposed to look like a cutting board. Looks well, like one of those. Yeah, it's too tall. That's what I was afraid of. It will have to go somewhere else. on top of the refrigerator. <laughs> this is what I've come up with for now. I really wanted this to go up here, but it's too tall. I'll add some more things down the road, but at least it's not empty. And I think it looks, it looks nice. 
Think that'll work for now? Yeah. I'm, I've got some more decorations and little knickknacks and signs and things that are still packed up in boxes. And I'll get to those eventually and probably put those up here. We've got plenty of shelves to decorate in this house. Are you crawling all over the place? Are you crawling all over the place? Come get me. Come get me. Go, boy, go. Go, boy, go. I got some mats at Dollar Tree to, to put at the doors. We've got pieces of extra carpet there right now. We're going to get rid of those and put those other little rugs down for now. Maybe I'll find something else in the future that I want to use, but for now I just need to get rid of these pieces of carpet because they are very muddy. I would need to put something else there. Can I walk? Is that okay? Can I walk? Yeah, we'll throw that away and then we'll just put this right here for now. We'll put one at each door. Are you gonna help me clean your bathtub? You want to help mama? Let's get what we need. Buddy, will you take this shower curtain and put it in y'all's bathroom for now? There's little fingers. Is that your little fingers I saw? <laughs> All right, you sit right here by mama. You sit right there by mama. Yep, you're gonna wanna pull up. Be careful. were in high school when they met and things got kind of awkward with sparks in the air he would stare at her in class and she would try to act cool but it was obvious like ooh. i was keeping my paper towels with my cleaning supplies because i didn't have anywhere to put them but now i do did you see my other video where we got this paper towel holder well, hello, <laughs> we got this paper towel holder from a sweet subscriber, Kathy. I'm gonna put all our paper towels on there. They will be together. Ooh. We've got to get going to ball practice. It's that time. I only had a little over an hour here to get things done that I needed to get done, but I fed my sourdough. It was needing to eat. <laughs> There's a whole video coming on that. It's been quite the learning process, but took care of that. Uh, we got those floors cleaned. We got these shelves done. We got the bathtub cleaned. So I'm feeling a little accomplished <laughs> now. We got to go to ball practice. And we've also got to figure out what we're going to do for supper tonight because ball practice nights are a little tough. It's too early to eat before and Justin's not home. And then it's late by the time we get done, especially if both boys have ball practice. But we're also not going to eat out every night. No, we're not. So, hope I don't eat my words and that's what we end up doing tonight. As long as we're fed, it'll be okay. But hopefully we'll be able to cook something at home. I guess we'll just have to see. For now, though, we got to get some cleats on and go to ball practice. I think you have about outgrown this seat. Oh, we need to ride. I know, I know. Let's ride, though. I looked up for another thing. We were young and we were free and running Never bothered about what could be coming Every day we danced and life was smiling We were young and drunk in love A few years later I have started thinking If it's just love in every glass I'm drinking
show me life is full of face. All right, so I think the plan for dinner is to get pizza and go back to the house and work on putting Huddy's bed together because it needs to be done. And there was a piece on it that was messed up when we got it, but Justin thinks he can fix it. So we're gonna see if we can get his bed put back together. So it's gonna be pizza for supper. That's going to be all for today. Thank you for spending some time with us. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe and join our family. Go check out some of our other videos and see if any of it interests you. And if it does, then hit that red subscribe button and join our crew. Also, don't forget that this video is a collab with Courtney from Courtney Danielle. And a link to her video will be down in the description box. Make sure you go show her some love. We love you. We appreciate you. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye, y'all.